Dustin Rosen with Rugby Sevens Magazine. I have Danny Barrett here from the USA Sevens team. Danny, the last couple of weeks, the last couple of months, last couple of tours, yeah. I will say. You guys have been kind of on cruise control going through pool play. And you've had some trouble here at home. Kenya gave you even a decent run yeah. last night with Argentina, losing at the last second. France held their own as well. Uh, what's been different about this tournament uh, so far? Yeah, you know, it's it's been pretty tough, like you said. You know, I wouldn't say we were in cruise control at all in those first four tournaments. They've been pretty tough for us, pretty physically demanding. You know, we lost Perry's kind of spe name speaks for himself, right? Um, but no, it's, it's getting used to a different pitch, a new ground, a tighter field. I think uh, there's a little bit of jitters being at home, but yeah, I mean, they're, they're all been quality opponents. I mean, full credit to them. They came out and really, really gave us a punch in the mouth. Yeah, definitely. A any sigh of relief just getting the France game out of the way now, knowing you're going into the quarters at home? No, not at all. I mean, it it's good to be in the quarters. It's good to keep that path of uh, trying to get to the top four, get the Olympic qualification. But, you know, we're at home. We want to do something special if we can. I mean, we're just glad to have a chance right now. Definitely. You know, it was, it was tough for us to get there, but we got a chance. We got some things to work on, uh, a few things to, to hash out in, uh, in a meeting in a few minutes. But... No, we, we're just glad to have a chance and ready to give it a shot. Last question, how good is it having Madison back on the roster now for USA being out last year here in Vegas? No, it's amazing. I mean, Madison's such a, a calm, cool, collective leader. You know, we, we got guys that lead in different ways, and Madison's kind of a, a combination of all of that, where he can kind of get in your face when he needs to, but at the end of the day, he's very cerebral. He knows exactly what he's saying, why he's saying it, and when to say it. And uh, having that confidence of, you know, this little pocket computer guy running around knowing exactly what to do at, at the exact right time. Absolutely. Thanks so much, guys. USA in the club quarters. Thank you, yeah, of course.